Carter left side. And then Carter with the dunk. When you start your My Team, they allow you to pick a starter pack. And whichever starter pack you pick, the guy is going to evolve. So you gotta pick Derrick Rose, T-Mac, VC, Dirk, Hakeem. It's all up to you. I ended up picking VC just because the picture had the purple Raptors jersey. Probably one of my favorites in NBA history. I also love D-Rose, so I was gonna pick either one of those, so it didn't really matter. So with my first five cards, I don't get anyone good except Andre Iguodala. Pretty good role player for starting my team. My second pack of five cards, I get Ersan Ilyasova, Sixes Arena. So guys, I'm so used to NBA Live Ultimate Team that I don't really know how my team on 2K works anymore besides the fact that you need tons of VC to buy packs from what I've heard and from what I've seen. So a lot of these cards, I have no idea what they do. And as you can see, the Vince Carter Evolution card. It can be upgraded by completed statistical milestones unique to each card. So it'll keep on increasing, 85 Vince Carter, 89 Vince Carter, that's going to be a nice challenge to do. I'm happy they have some challenges to do during the game so you don't get bored. I don't know what that card is, those last two cards I have no idea. So that's what my starting five is looking like. And now I got the pre-order bonus. The first pack is going to be Anthony Davis, the second pack is going to be Dwayne Wade. So here we go, Anthony Davis, 85 overall. Second pack is D. Wade. He is also an 85 overall. With the Miami Heat jersey. Okay. And then I got five league packs. I mean five league cards, my bad, not packs. So I'm gonna get a contract card. Avery Bradley, a good role player. Luke Walton. Phoenix Suns jersey and another contract card. So next is another heat check pack. It is going to be five cards again. I get a nice shoes right there. Up tempo I get Jordan Clarkson. And to upgrade Vince Carter I need six points in a single game. Not too bad. So let's check out his stats real quick. I'm assuming he has 70s everywhere since it is the first version of Vince Carter. 76 mid, 78 3, not too bad. So for my first game, I'm going to do a challenge, a multiplayer challenge, week 1 unlimited. And the only thing I changed is I took out Sabonis for Anthony Davis and I put Dwayne Wade on the bench for some firepower. And every time I play my first game, my opponents always have a better squad. He is an 82 overall, 6 points better than mine. He has John Wall, Jason Tatum. And he picked Hakeem as his starter pack. So here we go. First game, he has the Raptors jersey. Hopefully you guys are ready for my first game. It's not going to be pretty. Because I haven't played 2K in months. And I've been playing live since what? <laughs> since March, April. So I haven't played 2K in like 6 months maybe. So I'm so rusty at this game. Gotta get used to the mechanics and all of that again. And I still have... Oh, here's Vince Carter's first basket. I still haven't made a my player, a my career. I've made so many different builds. I just don't know what I want to play with yet. You know, I want to make a Clay Thompson build. But at the same time, I want to make a big man build. But then I have a point guard. I don't know. It's just too many different players that I want to play. So I don't know which one to use first. So I'm debating between my point guard is a two-way uh, playmaker, 61 badges, Russell Westbrook, John Wall build. And the second player I'm debating is a two-way sharp. He has a Klay Thompson build. So those are the two players I'm debating between or, you know, there's other builds I made, but those are the top two I'm debating between. But for now, I'm just going to be uh, doing this my team gameplay and then I have another game probably coming out tomorrow or the next day. So Anthony Davis with the fadeaway with a miss. Aaron Gordon with the rebound offensive putback. We are up 6-2. to two. So for my career, I don't know what I'm going to do with that yet. And as for NBA Live 19, I still have gameplays. Do not worry. I'm probably going to upload once a week for NBA Live 19. Because uh, I still have about like 10 games to go. 
And hopefully by then they they upload, <laughs> not upload, they come out with NBA Live 20 because you guys know it got delayed. So hopefully NBA Live 20 is still coming out. If it does, it's going to be great news because as of right now, NBA 2K with all the news that I'm reading, there's a lot of people with problems with the game. <laughs> some people are losing badges, some people are losing points as they play the game. Anthony Davis with a crazy shot, 100% smothered. That's what superstars do. They make crazy tough shots. So right now, Vince Carter is going to get his fourth point, third and fourth point with that layup. I only need two more points to complete the challenge. I get the steal, but then we ended up having a bad possession. He gets the fast break right here. We recover beautifully on defense. My point guard is playing great manual defense. I'm still playing manual defense when I'm coming back to 2K, trying to get back into the flow. John Wall with the mid-range, he misses. Jason Tatum with the rebound. Rudy Gay gets smothered. Or contested, should I say. So we get the ball back. That was a beautiful defensive possession from our squad. So I think this will be the last possession for his team. We're going to get another stop right here. Look at that double team strip. We're going on the fast break. Aaron Gordon coast to coast on Blake Griffin. He also has Blake Griffin off the bench. He was hiding his good players. Do you see that? So unfortunately, the game gets disconnected by 2K. It says the game will not count. But it's odd because when I look at my achievements, you're going to see that I'm getting trophies for winning the game. So it actually did count. But then when I get back on the menus, the game didn't count. So it's really weird. So you guys will see my trophies that I got for winning the game. I got, I think, three, three achievements. And then when I go back in the multiplayer challenge, it shows that I didn't even complete it. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to get flashed, please be sure to share and like this video. To stay updated, click subscribe and also follow GFlash on Twitter.